All right, doing a Daphne Blue from the Gretsch guitar. And so I recorded my voice using some Bluetooth earphones that have a microphone built in, but all you could hear was the background noise of the booth and the filters and the water, and you couldn't hear my voice. So I got to try something new. Anyway. On these, what I'll do is I'll paint the top surface there, as you can see, and down in the neck pocket where I just shot before, and then down in these little uh, routed out openings, I have to hit that area because when I hang it up here like this, I can no longer reach these places. So I like to have them already um, painted. So I'm trying to get out of the way here as I make things visible. So on Gretsch guitars, they don't get a white base coat like the Fender ones do. That was not something that Gretsch did. So I just put the uh, lacquer color right over the, uh, the wood. It's already been sealed, this guitar, and sanded, so it's not going on raw wood. So here I'm just painting the back. Daphne Blue is a pretty strong color, so it only takes a couple coats to get coverage. <laughs> Those things are constant struggle. So this is my pattern. Spray the sides and spray the back and spray the front. Now I'm doing the neck. and in the headstock area. It's easy to get it a little too heavy in that area because there's a lot of angles you wouldn't think of. Easy to make light spots and when you're trying to cover all those light spots, it's easy to put it on a little heavy in certain areas. If you're not careful, little nooks and crannies and crevices in there. Then doing the face of the headstock, you gotta be careful because the handle on there I used to hold it. It can create sort of a paint shadow if you don't do all the angles just right. See there, I'm getting it all these different ways. I don't want to have a shadow created by uh, that thing. So I think this one needed a little bit more attention in the sanding area because there's something on there I was seeing. So I think I set it aside here. But basically I uh, had that sanded down once it dried and uh, just did another coat, just like you saw me do the first one. And then it was a done deal. <laughs>